Ah, here it is. Come, let me show you. You see, right here, Scott. Hey guys, welcome back to. Um, really? What's this note? Welcome back to Skyrim. This is Cafe Gaming. Why well, did not mean to start the episode out like this? Let's read this note, shall we? The note here. Uh, I have a good reason to believe the target will be coming to Riften in the next few days. Discretion is preferred, but elimination of the target is of the highest priority. The usual restrictions on exposure are lifted. You will be reassigned outside Skyrim if necessary without penalty. Do not fail me. Signed, E. Um, is that how tails work? I guess that's how tails work. We are currently trying to get the heck out of Dodge. Um, where do you want us to? Yeah, we're, we're just going to go out this way, I think pretty sure we're just going out this way uh we've got esburn on our tail trying to survive the thalmor because we've got a lot of them to deal with holy flame matronach okay let's there we go got out oh my gosh i can't believe i had to wait until that thing dissipated to get out of there all right, we are getting out of town. So we are going, uh, real quick here to check out the map. We are going to Riverwood with him. Now, here's the thing, we could walk. We could walk that entire way. Uh, I'm not going to, we're just gonna teleport there. And I know that seems really uh, against usually what I would normally do, but I absolutely positively hate escort quests. And it is a long journey. So we're just gonna bypass all of that and just fast travel. Okay, we have made it. This is not looking good, is it? May the gods watch over your battle. Yeah, I certainly hope so. Okay, so we're heading into the giant, what is this? Sleeping giant inn. There's nothing more that I hate than escort quests. Delphi. Why, it's good to see you. It's been a long time. It's good to see you too, Esbern. It's been too long, old friend. Too long. Well, then. You made it safe and sound. Good. Come on, I have a place we can talk. Orgnar, hold down the bar for a minute, will you? Yeah, sure. Not this like way. anything's happening in here. Should I be watching out for the Thalmor, which have inevitably tailed us? Or been here the whole time? Honestly? Come on, Lydia. Get in here. A little bit further. Are we really doing this in the doorway? Okay, now good. Alright, we're here! Now then, I assume you know about... Oh yes, Dragonborn, indeed, yes. Well, this changes everything, of course. There's no time to lose. We must locate this. Let me show you. I know I had it here somewhere. Esbern, what? Give me just a moment. Yeah, he's gonna walk into the table. Ah, here it is. Come, let me show you. You see, <laughs> right here, Skyhaven Temple. Constructed around one of the main Akaviri military camps in the Reach during their conquest of Skyrim. Do you know what he's talking about? No, I'm confused. <laughs> this is where they built Aldrin's Hall to sit down and stone all their accumulated dragon lore. A hedge against the forgetfulness of centuries. A wise and foresighted policy in the event. Despite the far reaching fame of Aldrin's Wall at the time, one of the wonders of the ancient world. Its location was lost. Of course it was. Esbern, what are you getting at? You mean, you don't mean to say you haven't heard of all this wall? Either of you? Sorry. Let's pretend we haven't. What's Alduin's wall and what does it have to do with stopping the dragons? Alduin's wall was where the ancient blades recorded all they knew of Alduin and his turn. Part history, part prophecy. Its location has been lost for centuries, but I have found it again. Not lost, you see, just forgotten. The Blade's archives held so many secrets. I was only able to save a few scraps. 
So okay. you think that all this wall will tell us how to defeat Alduin? Uh, well, yes. But uh, no guarantee, of course. Skyhaven Temple it is, then. I knew you'd have something for us, Esbrin. Please don't die while I'm and gone. In the area of the breach that Esbrin's talking about, near what's now known as Karth Spire in the Karth River Canyon. I'm sure glad you knew what we're talking meet about. Meet there, or all travel together. Your call. Um, I'll meet you guys there. Your call. Might be safer to travel separately. Attract less attention that way. Don't worry. I'll get Esbrin there in one piece. We'll wait for you near Karth Spire. Good luck. Okay, and we also got this really cool book here, which has all sorts of things in it, and um, we're just going to take it with us. So, there. And they're going to be going by themselves. So, we're going to be meeting... Um... All the way over here. So we actually haven't been even remotely in this area. But we've got all sorts of places and things to possibly collect while we're there. In fact, it might be worth actually going to Markarth first and then traveling a little bit rather than just going across the way. And the best way to do that is actually to go to Whiterun and just take a carriage there. And while we're there, I think it's about time that we actually do some upgrading on our weapons. Are you kidding me? Can I help you? Out of my way, stranger. You just find that lying around? Must be your lucky day. Take care of yourself, What? 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 Yeah. What just happened? You too, Delphine. You'll be safe. Okay. So I have literally no idea what that was about. What find what? Lying around. So those two are gonna go and do their own thing. I'm gonna head to White Run and I'll meet you there. Okay, welcome back to White Run and couple things here. Um, first of all, I'm heading up to Dragon's Reach because it just dawned on me we have all of our money back, and that means we can finish upgrading our house. So I'm gonna head up there and actually get the rest of what I want. Okay, so I'm gonna get the bedroom Very furnishings. Well. Is there I am going like to get place? the loft decorations. Well. Is there anything else and I'm going to get the dining room decorations, well. which should finish up like everything. I am not adopting any children as of right now. So let me head down to Bree's home, show that off. Okay, welcome home to Bree's home. We have officially gotten everything decorated. So here's the, the kitchen area. And the, all the bedroom stuff should now be all decorated. Hooray! And we got a sweet roll. Uh, oh, well, okay, that's fine. Um, in this little... Th uh, actually, in this little drawer here, I'm going to be putting all of our books. Uh, I want to store all... Oh, quest items. Uh, um, I want to store everything that's not a duplicate in here. And I'm actually going to go ahead and just store everything. Okay, so everything in there is stored. Now in this chest here, I think what I want to do is just store anything else of interest that we don't necessarily want to keep with us. I don't think we have a lot of special items. We do have a lot of elven armor that we might want to consider keeping. I'm going to go ahead and store that. Um, That all works. I'm going to store the special bow. It's actually not as good, but it's a, oh, it's a quest item. So we're actually going to keep it with us apparently. And lastly, if you head down here, there is the alchemy room. I'm gonna store all of my ingredients. Okay, so after all of that, we have definitely decreased the amount of stuff that we have. Now, my biggest thing right now is I wanna see if I can find a better weapon while I'm here. Uh, definitely would be worthwhile, as well as sell the excess stuff, uh, like the books and stuff that we have. So I'm gonna start by going in here and seeing uh, what kind of weapons I can get to replace the one that I have. Okay, so after reviewing pretty much everybody's store stock, uh, I ain't got crap that I can get here. Like, I can't purchase anything better than the weapon that I already have, which is actually really infuriating. So really what I need to do is to um, upgrade my smithing so I can make my own stuff. I'm not really surprised. Uh, honestly, I kind of assumed that's how this was going to go kind of not happy about that but there's just we don't have anything 
that beats 13 damage right now. That's a really, really low, by the way. So we're gonna want to eventually either do a quest line or go search out a better sword, but uh, not really sure what we wanna do there. So we wanna start by going to uh, Markarth. I was going to just walk there because it's a long trip and we get a lot on the map, but it's also a long trip. So instead of walking there, we're gonna be taking a little bit of a uh, shortcut. Kind of. What's going on down here? What you guys the wind blows doing the down there? Uh, those are the traveling Khajiit. Um, <laughs> not entirely certain why they're just standing down there. Okay, so first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over here to the stables and talk to this guy here. And we're gonna go to Markarth. Okay, so if we do this, uh, I'm working on it. Just, jeez. Ever been to Markarth? Some say it was built by the dwarves. I don't believe a word of it. Hilarious. Thanks, game. Okay, so we are now in Markarth. Yeah, we are all the way over here. We have a ton of stuff that we have not yet explored or anything like that. Uh, we need to go out into the world to actually start this, but I'm gonna do this, like I'm gonna be doing this um, next time because we've got a lot. Like we have a ton. We don't know if anything over here other than the fact that we're probably gonna end up dead. So I hope to see you guys next time.